A Bite at Freddy's is a new fan game where you work with a chef to uh, confirm fast food orders. I beat the main game, all the challenges, the max custom night, and then the secret max max custom night. But that's not what's in this video. This video is just the main game. The challenges in max night will come soon. Will this game destroy my PC? Five nights at Bitcoin mining? <laughs> yeah, true. <laughs> I just unintentionally agreed for my computer to become a Bitcoin mine for somebody. Is there no audio? Oh, my bad chat. I ain't understand a lick of it. It's been a pleasure. Shit, I missed the couple, first couple dialogue things. That's okay, I'm sure you'll fill me in. Machine maintenance. Oh my God, the vape machine. Freddy Fazbear's Grill is seeking assistance in testing and repairing the Freddy Faz food, Faz food vape machine. Should I move? So you guys can see this grill. I haven't touched this chat. It's been five days since it came out and I haven't streamed uh, Besides cooking since then. So no, I haven't. Welcome to Freddy Fazbear's grill. Today we'll be testing out old food delivery system. We need to run through its course a few times from kitchen to customer. Wild. Boy, what the hell is this? I don't know. I'll be up in the kitchen making orders, putting them on the delivery system's conveyor belt. They'll be down, they'll be sent down to party room A, then party room B, then finally your office. I need you to confirm orders as they arrive in these rooms. Rooms can be viewed using the camera system, which lets you check out anything in the building. Conveyor openings seen in the kitchen and party rooms can be closed remotely on their cameras with the button activated doors. They'll pause incoming orders while closed. Wow. There's an order status indicator to the left of your office. Once it says delivered, find the order in the building and confirm its arrival. Careful. Careful. Uh, if anything's acting up with the conveyor, you can stop it using the lever to your left. This will stop progress on incoming orders. Given a mighty push, the power could overload and need a full reboot. As a heads up, you might see some robot critters, critters moving around the building. <laughs> Don't worry, they won't bite. They're just taking a stretch. Just switch off those lights to your right. If you want to be alone, make some scurry on. Oh. If you see that cowbird chica swing by, pick up the toy pistol on your desk and activate her new showdown mode. If you're quick and aim between the eyes, you might even win a free soda. All right. Alrighty now. Let's get a move on. It seems... Okay. Why did the power load go what down when I on? turned on the power? So, Lad is- he's- he's- he's baking, except he's not baking, but whatever. And then it goes down to here, and here, and here. Oh, this isn't a timed thing. It's a object- finish objectives thing, isn't it? Is there a boop? Oh, 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 we were sending the order. There's supposed to be like an order or something? I don't think I've missed too much else. Do I have to like catch it? Oh yeah. Oh. Okay. Yippee. State of Decay 2, I actually tried to get State of Decay work running on an old computer of mine. And like I pirated it. It was so complicated because it wasn't just a simple pirate. I also had to get a crack, and like I didn't know how to do that as a kid that well. And I finally got State of Decay working, and it didn't run for shit on my computer. And I was so sad, and I just never touched it again. So that's my thought on State of Decay. I really wanted to play it, and then I, I couldn't after all my pirating efforts. It was harder to run than Skyrim. Okay. I will be streaming a little bit less. For the next couple weeks just because i went super hard on that quiz video and probably wednesdays close the door oh on the bird that makes sense we don't want the bird in the vent <laughs> cool gaming spiff the power oh huh? button looks cool if nothing else this game is going to be a banger because of its unique Look. Oh yeah, I should turn the power off. True, so true, so true, so true. Okay, so that's somebody's hat. I thought it was like a fucked up chair, but it's a hat, isn't it? Perry, the platypus, is that you? That's the phone guy, is it? Oh yeah, cause he's cooking. Oh, food is on the way. So I don't think this is supposed to be that hard. I just fucked up Bonnie. Let's see, Chica's the finger gun. 
Bonnie hides there, and I have to cut power. And then the rat tries to go in my vents, I guess. This seems, like, fairly straightforward. Guy, I wonder how this gets hard. Rat wants food. Oh, this is the rat. I think. What do you do when you hit 700k subs on YouTube? Go for 800. But yeah, actually, um, I totally forgot about this. Somebody, somebody brought it up to me. A year ago, January 1st of this year, I tweeted out, I was at 422,000 subs, and I was like, haha, goal for this year is 690,000. We're going from 420 to 69. And uh, yeah, we just hit 69. So the year's goal is complete. My, I guess my goal now would probably be like 750 or even 800 by the end of the year, but we'll see. These lads have no legs. <laughs> <laughs> How the fuck are they supposed to kill me with no legs? Bunch of little mini monties. Today my friend got put into a cast. Bro's got he told no me legs. to punch it. Oh. I did. I cut two of my knuckles. Dude, but the shock, Ben? What the fuck? Thanks for the 28 months. The shock. Surely if your friend has something broken in there of like getting your Winning? That would kill your friend, surely, Ben. Ben's friend likes the pain. I guess so. I busted too early. It's okay. I was able to double bust. It's your 21st on Saturday. Yeah, becoming an adult is weird because you never actually... There is no line that you cross where suddenly you're prepared for adult stuff. Oh, well, I'm okay with that. This is how I like to learn these games is by trial and error. Just be nice if the trial what was it like five minutes long. Turn off thing when sound, you know? Can confirm I'm 28 and there's absolutely never a moment where you wake up and go, I'm an adult now. Yeah, exactly, yeah. You just pretend and get better at pretending. That legless guy killed you. <laughs> How did that make you feel? He had an advantage because he's coming out of an opening at eye level. If we were in a hallway, no problem. So as long as I do just have to stop the conveyor when scary sound, then I've probably got the night case. <laughs> this guy's little hat poking out. I haven't looked anything here. I mean, you can see the lads scurrying around, but... Oh shit, chat. Order three. I bet you there's six orders. Or maybe not. Maybe there's only three orders. Yeah, I mean, it only looks like there's three. And no power? No, we're neutral power. Looks like the only way you can overload your power is by stalling the the machine, the, the conveyor. Which is another classic FNAF move where it's harder on your power to stop things from working than it is to have them working. I heard a certain John from FUNAF is going to fly out to Mr. Spiff someday. Yep. FUNAF, by the way. I guess I survived Bonnie, but just barely. Did he make it in? What do I do in this situation, chat? I guess I win. So when the cams go dark, that's just them switching positions. This last month has been quite stressful, but I saw the video of you playing the joy of creation and I've been a lot more happier. Nice. Did that old bulb blow up? Well, there should be a box of the spare bulb in the office somewhere. If you could swap that out for me real quick. Really? Oh, oh, right there. <laughs> it's about time that bow got replaced. Say, ain't it getting a little stuffy around here to you? Well, we got a nice vent fan to really freshen up this air. It's right above your office. Ain't that nice? Yeah. It's connected to the camera system. Feel free to give it a try. It gets awful dusty in those oh. vents. Now let's get some more orders going. Nice. Adding in mechanics slowly not fucking all in the first night let's go i assume i have to turn it on when the shit gets dusty oh here's the cool i 
Cool. As soon as he starts moving back, you're good to. Oh. Just to no! Bad for Doodle. Okay, maybe not. For Doodle can get a bit closer. It's okay. I'll allow that. Oh, there he goes through that vent. Well, that's kind of fun. He moves fast, though. Like, I don't know if there's another stage. Like, I don't know if he would have gone from here to here and then gone in. I I'm not sure. What is the fan doing? Check the vent. Fuck off! I see. So Freddy is Freddy's fan then. They seem to react to the, to the things you do to stop them really quickly. Yeah, like you do this. Oh, you know, eat my ass, Freddy, and then. Okay, never mind. <laughs> I guess he doesn't feel like it. Um. Cool. Okay, now he's really going for my ass. I mean, he looks like he wants those fries. He can have him, I guess. Cool. Chilling like a cool cucumber chat with a bit of a high power load. Some cool news about Poppy, actually. Uh, the director added me on Discord and we chatted a little bit. Nothing crazy, just like, hey, champ. I hope you enjoy the game. I also, I, I don't, I think I might get the game early because I'm in the, I'm in the crew or whatever. But I probably won't play it early because, you know, stream. But uh, it's it's cool to be connected like that. They've been really good with uh, human connection with their games. I think I heard some of them rusty screws pop out of the conveyor. My hat's too big to fit inside there. So if you could head in and swap them out for me, that would be mighty nice. Screws collected. Click a screw to collect. Redirect. Click and hold. Huh? Okay. There we go. <laughs> Screws replaced. Oh. Oh, that's kind of annoying. Hmm? Am I... Can I grab that distant one? I'm kind of confused what I did wrong there. Like, this seems like the objectively correct thing to do, but then... What, what did I do wrong with that other one? Okay, let me run, let me, let me try that again. <laughs> so, say no to Bonnie. Say no to Bonnie again. Oh, okay, well, I guess I was just late then. Say no to Bonnie a third time. Okay, this is it. Last run through the orders. If the camera starts having trouble, Give them a refresh through the backstage camera. If a robot messes with them, old wires in the back, a refresh should shock them away. If the camera's got completely frozen up, you can switch to backup. That puts on that rickety office power, so best keep them refreshed. Get ready, last round of orders are coming. So... Seems pretty straightforward. Bruh. Foxy time? Is Foxy gonna mess with the <laughs> cameras? I just wanna dual Chica more. <laughs> That's like... Wait. No. Okay. I love my, my quick time gun events. Why no Kahoot stream? Well, okay. Now that the FNAF YouTuber quiz is done, we need to find another thing to bring the lads together. Hey, Foxy. I reached out to Super Horror Bro. He's another that I want to add. And he's like, oh, hell yeah, champion. I would so totes business. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So we got him. Super Horror Bro is a Little Nightmares guy. Just because you've only seen his Little Nightmares videos doesn't mean he's a Little Nightmares guy. Because uh, that's actually very similar to my Super Horror Bro experience. But he hasn't made a, a Little Nightmares video in a few years, I don't I think. A... Maybe he did with, like, the release trailer of 3. I mean, that FNAF is kind of the game that connects us, but there's a number of other IPs that would connect us. FNAF just has an enormous amount of diversity. 
Hence, I mean, shit like this. Yeah, help one and two might open some doors to... Hey, Foxy. To something that I could do with, uh... Super Horbo's making a game, hey? So he's fairly busy with that. I wouldn't. I wouldn't, uh... Oh, shit! <laughs> we got a head! <laughs> Let's go! Head gang. Honk it. That's pretty pathetic. So, is this headless beast going to attack me? We watch every day as our anniversary service That is very cool. I hope you have a great, uh... And a bursary. What's going on? <laughs> yeah, hi. Oh. Okay. Ah, I heard him. Hitless bitch. Big, what about a drawing stream like Scribble IO and have all of us join? It'd be a fun, like, we have to draw characters. That would be a fun idea. What if someone types the N-word? Oh my gosh. Be careful, Spig. The intelligent, like, respectful, non-stupid YouTuber buddies are gonna type the N-word. Oh, what a risk. That's actually why it's a risk at times to play with just anybody, but, uh... You know what, chat? Believe it or not, I would trust Super Horror Bro to not type the N word. <laughs> Mike can be trusted, but what if I would I would say, oh, you are bad, Mike, bad. And then I probably wouldn't play with him again. <laughs> Pretty crazy course of action. I know, I wouldn't even know what to do with myself. What if Hugo Punch took over his body? Then he'd have, you know, he, Problems that his youtuber buddies couldn't help him with I, I wouldn't get the Hugo punch out of his body That would be up to him and his family. I think draw plink Unfortunately, I know this is gonna hurt your feelings, but I bet you That most of them wouldn't know what plink is if you're not on twitch You don't really see plink that often Is this the backup now? I'm confused. Oh, it, it is the backup. So I'm on the backup, which means every time I open cams now, it's gonna use power. Which like probably ends my attempt. Immediately. Yeah, you got this? I'll try. Oh, it's you. <laughs> Still alive, although barely. Oh, God. Yeah, no, I have to take care of... I have to take care of the cams thing. Backup cams are bad news bears. <laughs> Why is Foxy nerdy? Well, I think it's because he's sick. like... Yeah, yeah, it's, he's like a laboratory guy. He make thing. He cook, but science-like. Scientist? No, a spacist. Not <laughs> Walter White. I'm starting to learn the, the difference in sound. My favorite- oh my gosh. Foxy's like lustily looking at those chords. Oh, I just want to- Eat those fucking cords. Yeah, look at him go! Yeah, you look at me like that all you want. When you turn off the fan, that's what it is. It kind of sounds like a saw stop when you turn off the fan. Like, it sounds like the blade's getting eaten. Oh, oh my gosh. Stupido. I didn't, I didn't catch the sound. Yeah. Have you ever seen the video of, like, the hot dog and the saw stop? Very cool. With ultra slow down. I saw- I saw a video of a saw stop. Okay. Little- little run through if you don't know what a saw stop is. 
uh, table saw. Really destructive blade. And a saw stop, like, fingers, something about conductive electricity better than wood. So, as the saw stop design, where as soon as it detects that meat has touched it, it, like, jams something into the saw and drops it, and it's able to instantly stop a, a, a table saw, which is, is an absurd task. Like, it destroys the entire machine, but it prevents you from being cut. It uses gunpowder? Okay, yeah. You can't stop a saw like that instantly without destroying the blade, and the saw stop itself gets destroyed. So, yeah, it's you were the saw, really. You're right, yeah. I saw a couple comments when I was looking through a video of a saw stop that are like, yeah, this is a pretty good product, but, uh, you know, it would be nice if it didn't destroy the blade. Like, what the fuck are you suggesting, bro? How the fuck would you pull that off? Like, oh, yeah, you're right. You're right. Yeah, maybe if they just, uh, you know, like, pressed a brake pedal on it or something. Maybe that would work. No. <laughs> it would cut through your hand, your mom's hand, your neighbor's hand before it would even slow down. I did wood shop in high school and, you know, our, we, we got told about the saw stop and he was like, yeah, like you owe us like 250 bucks if you use it, but it will protect you. Yeah. What's up, partner? What? I won't. Huh? I missed? Bruh, where? <laughs> Terrible hit rag. I think I shot too early, yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, bro's going for that wire riz, you're right. Yeah, I know you want those wires, big guy. Zoinks. My hyperfixation is on new metal, so I have to tell my funny little facts. It is okay. a good Did I miss? Je ne sais pas. <laughs> Yeah, you just you just keep giving a hundred bits every time I die, brick. You're probably ready on the keyboard. If Saki stares at you after you refresh him, he'll go to Cam 5 vent. Oh, okay. Top three fan games? Easy. Glitch Attraction, Joy of Creation, Juniors. What about Post Shift 2? Oh yeah, yeah. Top three worst fan games. Post Shift 2. <laughs> Chica's Party World is fucking sick. <laughs> That's the thing, Chad. I just, I like games for weird reasons sometimes. I think the worst thing a game can be is not unique. And boy, is Chica's Party World unique. I lost, didn't I? I really tried to wait that time. Did I wait? <laughs> <laughs> I'm out of bits after this dono, not like this. Yeah, you better be. <laughs> I'm never gonna die again now that you're out of the... Or do I just have to get between the eyes? All right, all right, all right. All right. I guess I'm a bad shooter. I'll keep trying. <laughs> Sounds like Swift's having a skill issue. What is that? It's Connor's skill issue. I didn't realize he had one. Between the eyes. We good? I think we're good. Oh, he gonna be Madge now. He is Madge. Damn, okay. Bro is mega tilted. Relax, dude. Just cause you're trash? Don't mean you gotta take it out on me. He becomes super active after decapitation. It's actually a negative if you decapitate him. Hello, Pesh. Can you stay for a minute? I can do a minute. Okay, cool. I gotta I gotta sweat a bit. And then I'm hopefully gonna win. Let's go! Yeah, okay, we're good. You heading up? Yeah, I'm gonna go. Alright. Okay. Have a good afternoon, Paige. Yeah. Do you have a good cowboy accent that you can read this line in? <laughs> Okay, that's all we need to do. <laughs> Thanks for the help. Head over to the dining area and I'll get you on your way. Sounds good. Bye. Bye-bye, Pish. You know, Paige, 
would be better at a cowboy voice than I am. She's got more cowboy in her than I do. <laughs> Yeehaw! Thanks for the help. The manager. Final course? You're awfully committed, ain't you? Or are you just looking for another bite? I'm gonna try with up something real nice to top it off. I tell you, back in this day, this place was jumping. We had families in and out all day, new shows, events, the whole works. It all changed after the bite happened. Some kid went up and bit a huge chunk right out of Fred Bear's face. Tore it right off. Oh. Now he just sits there all alone on the stage inside the wall, slowly withering away. The crew thinks he ought to be called Threadbare. A bit crooked, ain't it? Oh. One more thing. Sometimes the conveyor gets jammed around the party rooms. If that happens, just stop the conveyor for a little bit and it'll restart itself. Yeah. Remember to refresh those cameras when they're acting up, campies. I'm sure that you can lose your connection. Anywho. Ahem. <clears throat> anyway. Uh, pardon my wobbling jar. Let's get her going. I like this phone guy. He doesn't go, um, uh, ooh, uh, ooh, uh. Unlike somebody. <laughs> Day shift. Spiff, have you and Paige decided what you're wearing for Halloween? E maybe. We kind of want to do mono and six because of Ellen 3 coming out next week. I also fucking love Mono. I do, however, already have a frog costume. <laughs> well, no, I would do both. Frog and then something else. You got a FNAF trailer? Chat, I think you getting a FNAF trailer on my stream is just like the advertising genies doing a good job. I think that might be a bit of intelligent targeted advertising going on. Uh, I plan on seeing it opening night, but I mean, if not opening night... Excuse me, I'm just gonna... If not opening night, the next day, like, as soon as I can, really. And then I'm gonna get bukak! <laughs> and I'm gonna make a video on it, too. And I'll make sure my thumbnail has the most spoilery picture possible. No, I won't, chat. I don't get the the upsetness at it coming out on Peacock as well as in theaters. I don't know why fans are upset about that. It'll reduce sales? That's okay, it's still gonna do well. Actors don't get residuals from streaming. Oh, where's the money go then? Wouldn't they have gotten part of like the bulk cost though? I see. Oh, I didn't know that. That's too bad. Didn't the writer's strike, like, wasn't it a success also, though, too? Ah, fuck. <laughs> so shouldn't some of those things be helped as well? Did I go over my power? Oh shit, I think I did. Yeah, okay, my bad. Oh, this is fun. This is like high action gaming. Give me likes. Okay, eat the wires already, bro. He's like savoring his wire snack. Oh, just gonna look at it a little bit. Well, once I figured out uh, the bird, my insane FPS skills. Look, the whole gang. Wow. We'll make it so I never miss another shot ever again. If I ever miss that shot again, you're allowed to skill issue me. It almost feels not worth it to... 
Cause like I have this. That works pretty well. Dude, the conveyor getting jammed is a humongous punch in the pants, chat. <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh, I did hit overload. Ah. Uh... Pretty dead there, unfortunately. Skill issue? Hey, at least I didn't die to Chica. So I guess using these doors doesn't take a ton of power, so that's the advantage as opposed to this. But like, I don't know. Took Super Horror Bro 10 attempts. Yeah, that sounds about right. My coworker locked me in the freezer. Also, what's this game about? Cooking. I got, well, no, you can't really, like the place that I was at, that had like a big walk-in freezer, the old folks home. You couldn't really be locked in the freezer, but the door could be closed on you. And that was, that was freaky enough. I remember having to wash like the food racks in the freezer. So like I would just be chilling in there, door closed. I'd be like trying to get the soapy water on me a little bit just to stay warm. It was kind of fun because it was hot water that I was cleaning with. Not locked, just closed. Okay, I really have to pay attention to, uh, this. What was the last non-Twitch job you worked? Uh, a video editing. But before that... Oh, yeah! So, the last video I had before video editing and then, and then my own content was... Uh, the rough pet food job. So, so cutting raw meat with a bandsaw into little pucks for, for cats and dogs. And I decided to buy some for loaf because I think it'll be healthy and they remembered me it was nice they were like oh david oh <laughs> how you doing and they you know they <laughs> that was one of the jobs that fired me though they did it in a fairly nice way and maybe i wasn't a bad employee that's i thought they fired me because i was too slow but uh they told me that it was because they were going into a season where they didn't need as many employees i didn't believe them but maybe they were telling the truth yes there are some valid reasons i mean it's a tiny business it's like it's like a family business so there are valid reasons that they could have curbed me movies coming out a day early in my town I already got tickets for the 27th though nice you could uh, go a day early and then spoil it for as many people as possible on the internet. I can't believe you'd give up that opportunity. Turning off the power is for Bonnie. You may have not seen him. He's intentionally hiding. There he is. And you see his little eyes come up. And then once they go down, I can turn the lights back on. And we are back in business. What? Damn, I made it to the end a couple times. How's the prediction? What is it? Beat this course in four tries? Is this the last attempt? So I feel like it's, I guess these are just fairly long attempts. This is the second attempt? Oh, so it's a new prediction then. So he needs to make a real time Freddy's game, literally an eight hour shift. That would be awful, but boy, would it be impressive to beat. Oh my gosh, what an unhealthy challenge that would be. Like, a, you know, a game like this, or whatever. And then it's just fucking eight hours. Like, I guess I would. I'd have to get real fucking good, though. No worse than security breach 600%? Yeah. But, like, it wouldn't just be one go and then you do it. Like, 600% takes forever, but you do it. You can't fail, really, as long as you keep going. Like, imagine playing five and a half hours and then you make a mistake and you have to restart that's that would be the unhealthy part <laughs> that'd be so fucked <laughs> like that's like an entire stream and then we just lost and everything was for nothing what if you had checkpoints 
that kind of takes away from it as, as much as that is a good thing. But yeah, I can see, okay. Checkpoints for the casual player, but then like a special achievement for doing it in one go. Okay, we need to we need to get the power down. Oh, delivered. Oh, oh, hello. We're back, chat. Order three. Yippee! You've only ever seen one Nuzlocke. Can you guess which one? That's funny. Yeah, I can. Animatronics missing. Mystery at Freddy Fazbear's Grill. Recently, the throw robot animatronic performers, they've gone missing. The grill's been undergoing renovations. Uh, well, it sure is. Well, it sure is sad since we just got them fixed up. They've honestly been acting screwy for years. Honestly, I'm not all that shaken up about this myself. The robot's a great and all, but food is really the heart of it. If you want some g good old cooking and some big smiles, come on over, come on over to John's Barbecue and Foot Massage. Jones barbecue and foot massage. Jones barbecue and foot massage. Oh, yeah, it was fun. It's not that hard. Nice and a healthy challenge. What now? I think there's still some more challenge. Talk show Freddy, talk show Bonnie, talk show Chica, talk show Foxy, thread bear. Bro got bit. That's so funny. Oh. Ooh, I love wires. Go on, not get married. Stick them up. Let's crunch. Face the music. Celebrate. This may have felt short because the bulk of the game is in the challenges. I just wanted to get this out so the challenges made sense and because it was a fun little stream. Things get real with the challenges in Max Knights, so you can look forward to that video in a bit.